Good to have your company this Saturday morning. Firefighters are working to contain an out-of-control bushfire in Western Victoria, which has now been burning for nearly two days. Joining me live, Victoria SES State Response Controller Tim Wybush. Tim, good morning. Um, what is the latest? Yes, good morning. I guess the latest is that we've still got a very active fire up around uh, the Bain Dean um, Mount Cole area, and so we are alerting those communities in and around, particularly Elmhurst, um, Mount Lonark, um, and also up towards um, the northern aspects of Amphitheatre, to be alert to the fact that there is still very much an active fire in there. The fire has grown around a thousand hectares overnight, and we still have an emergency warning uh, out for that area and two watch and acts for the surrounding areas. What's the latest with control on some of those fires? Because it's a vast area, isn't it? Yes, look, this bushfire is certainly not yet under control. The good news is that uh, the con weather conditions over the coming day will be more favourable for that direct attack on that fire. Um, we'll have around about 500 firefighters and a, a range of aircraft back on the fire again today, as there have been overnight last night. Tim, what's some of your basic advice to people living in that area? Look, for people that are living in the footprints of the emergency warning and the watch and acts, we are advising people that it is not safe to return. Um, relief centres are available at Ararat, Ballarat and also at Maryborough should people need to access those. History would prove times like these aren't time for outrageous acts of bravery. You've just got to listen to officials, don't you, and, and follow the rules? Yeah, absolutely. There's a range of road closures in place. Um, we don't want people taking risks while there's still very much an active firefight underway uh, for this fire. All right, Tim. Thanks so much for joining us on the program this morning. Thank you.